Imagine being so legendary, so iconic that an eight acre maze gets created in your honor. Bob Barker has been larger than life for decades, but a farm about an hour north right up 79 just took that notion to a whole new level. We can't wait to show this to you. Katie is live at Iron Mills Farmstead in New Wilmington, Pennsylvania to show us around. This seems incredible, Katie. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is so incredible. We're having here for an absolutely beautiful morning at the farmstead. I'm joined by the owners, Stacy and Rob. Stacy, please tell us just a little bit about how the farmstead came to be. Oh, geez. Well, we wanted a fun place to raise our family. We were actually inspired by Little People Big World on TLC, which is so crazy, but we wanted this fun place to raise our family. We tried to be farmers. We realized we were not farmers. <laughs> not farmers, definitely we, not. We couldn't grow anything uh, except kids. We did keep them alive, which was good. Um, and we decided to try our hand at agritainment and it's been super fun. We're in our 12th season and we just love hosting families in our region. Now there's so much happening here. This is such a beautiful campus almost right here at the farm. But the most notable thing this year is you had originally scheduled uh, your corn maze to be Bob Barker theme in honor of his 100th birthday. Now it's just a remarkable tribute to the late great Bob Barker. Tell us about the corn maze. Well, we originally wanted to give away a car. That's how this whole thing started. Rob actually came up with the idea. He's like, let's give away a car. And he has amazing ideas. I'm like, let's do it. And we're like, how can we do it? And we thought, Rob's like, well, what if we did a game show? And well, what game show? Well, he loves the Price is Right. So did I growing up, obviously. We looked up. We're like, Bob Barker's turning 100 this year. This is back in June. Um, we're like, he's turning 100. We have to do it it's this perfect. year. Yeah. And unfortunately, he didn't quite make it to 100, but he did make it to his 100th year. And we are still so honored to, to really just be a part of his legacy here. Now, this is such a wonderful tribute and just such an exciting, creative idea. Rob, tell us, what has the feedback been like so far for this, uh, for this setup and for the Bob Barker experience? Oh, it's awesome. I mean, think about, you know, as a kid growing up during the summers, um, when you're at your grandparents' house and you're, I, Price is Right. I mean, everybody knows about The Price is Right, you know, and Bob Barker was a legend in TV, you know, and, you know, everybody that's heard about it and some of the, the some of the people that got a little uh, inside scoop that knew what we were doing said that's awesome. So we're super excited. It's going to be really fun and an, an opportunity to, to honor a legend. So Wonderful. It really is so beautiful. Now, what else do you have happening here at the Farmstead throughout this season? We have over 40 fun attractions. We're super family friendly. Um, kids love it here. They, they come in with tons of energy and leave crying because they don't want to leave um, and sleep on the way home. So parents, that's your message. It's the greatest place on earth. Um, and so we just love hosting families. We have all kinds of things. I mean, I, I don't even have time to list them all. Well, we don't have to list them all. We definitely don't have time for me. Well, hopefully, actually, we have time. Do you want to go down the zip line? I could try the zip line, perhaps, but I'm supposed to be trying the corn maze. Do you have any pro tips for me to, to go through the corn maze, the Bob Barker corn maze? I have to tell you, I don't get into that corn maze too much. Yeah, I'm a little nervous. I haven't been in there in years. I just design it. I do everything else, but I don't ever walk in there. So good luck. What? I hope you don't get lost. Do we know the longest that somebody's ever spent in there? I mean, we have gotten phone calls from people that were like, I'm lost. Like they called the main number and they're like, we're lost. We need someone to come help us. And we did. We found them. Oh no. <laughs> Welcome to my nightmare. Well, in addition to the beautiful corn maze, there's also this really amazing big wheel here. It's just like the price is right. The kids are loving it. Heather and David, there's so many fun things to do here. Hopefully I make it out of the maze alive. I love that people call and <laughs> I can't get out. Send help. Oh my god. You know gosh. what? Keep your cell phone with you, Katie. If you get lost, yeah. you, we will help you. I'm calling you. Okay, all right. Yes. Call me. I get lost. I'm calling okay. you. All right. Phone a friend. We'll come this in with like so a amazing. helicopter from above. And can I just tell you, like, <laughs> heading up there was a viewer that reached out to us and they said, you have to check this yeah. out. This is so amazing. It was planned before Bob Barker passed away. And I am so glad we have amazing viewers who are constantly reaching out right. telling us about these incredible things. Absolutely. And what a tribute now to him, knowing, you know, with him just passing away. It's really so something creative. special. Really. Well, Irons Mill Farmstead goes big for their corn maze really every year. And for more info on all of this, go to our website, PittsburghTodayLive.com.
Katie.com. I hope we're not getting phone calls from Katie anytime soon. <laughs> no, keep your phone nearby <laughs> just in case she loses her way.